think that honestly it's been known for a very long time that heart rate and respiratory rate do increase in animals with pain. I think one example would be when we have a dog under anesthetic for instance and it becomes too light. Um, obviously these dogs are under surgery so they're going to be having pain. You know heart rate and respiratory rate are probably the first two things that we'll see elevated because of their experiencing pain. And we do know that dogs that are in acute pain will pant, and so respiratory rate is certainly a factor there. Um, and what we're uh, looking at is whether or not um, chronic pain shows up with uh, resting respiratory and resting heart rate. And that might not be so clear, but we believe that the chronic stress of pain changes chemicals in the body like cortisol and epinephrine which in chronic pain are always elevated because they're always feeling pain and so we believe that uh, there are you know increases in the resting heart rate and resting respiratory rate as well due to pain.